Hello and welcome to the channel. I'm Ominous and today I will review the Christmas album from Phil Spector. A Christmas gift for you from Phil Spector, so there we go. Um, I have no idea that Phil Spector works on a Christmas album. And I have never really an idea what Phil Spector did in music. Uh, you know, I thought he was just a... Um, a successful artist or something, a solo artist or something, but apparently he is a producer. I believe I knew that, but yeah, you know, I never really scoped him out or something, never looked into him. Of course, I know about the murder charges. I believe he was uh, in jail or something for a while, you know, and that's why he isn't really, you know, on a lot of production because he was a time in jail. So there we go. I, I think that at least. But uh, we have this classic album right there, 13 tracks, requested by Steven Young, of course. The genre is actually Christmas and R&B. I didn't even know that there was a Christmas genre, but there you go. Apparently it is a, um, a compilation album. I didn't even know that. Yeah, a compilation album of, you know, uh, it's a various artist kind of uh, thing. So this is not even a Phil Spector album in a way, really. If you really think about it. Uh, but I believe this is his most famous work. Although, you know, he is a producer. Yeah, he is the, uh, the main producer on this record. And he has various artists doing, um, you know, this album right here. Um, recorded at Gold Star Recording Studio. I have not really a lot to say about this record, honestly. The, you know, it's Christmas, or you know, uh, if this video is up, it is Christmas, and uh, now it is a day before that. And I cannot really argue with this record, honestly. Like, all the classics are on here. White Christmas is on there. Frosty the Snowman is here. The Bells of St. Mary's, like, just classic. Uh, Santa Claus coming to town. The Crystals, uh, Sleigh Ride, Marshmallow World, Just Tasty, I saw Mommy, Ki Mommy Kissing, Santa Claus Adorable, Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer, which is arguably, arguably my favorite, my all time favorite Christmas song, arguably. It's just such an adorable track, it really is. Winter Wonderland, which is just quite magical. Parade of the Wooden Soldiers is just. Um, yeah, it's just timeless honestly, it's just a timeless kind of jangle. It's just a timeless track honestly. Um, Christmas Baby Please Come Home might be the cheesiest song honestly, but it's still a very fitting song for the holidays and just an overall classic. Uh, here comes Santa Claus, you know, indicating that Christmas is about to start while this record is ending, but you know, we were waiting for that. And then uh, you have the, the so appropriate closing song, The Silent Night, du, 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 you know, just amazing. Uh, Phil Spector and artists actually, um, you know, are the artists on there. Um, yeah, and Phil Spector basically does a, a spoken word on this with, of course, the beautiful Silent Night, so Silent Night instrumental on there. Which, and it, it's just such a iconic, such a fitting closing song to this record, honestly. Like, I can't go in depth about this so these songs, honestly, but they really speak for themselves, really. It's just, you know, I, w I would debate with uh, Charlie Brown that this is the greatest Christmas album ever, of course. It's just such a classic, like all the classic songs are on there. Like, you know, you know uh, Phil Spector just did such a great job on producing this thing. Uh, you know, getting all the all the artists on there that created these t tunes and just made the greatest Christmas album ever. So yeah, my um, you know what's the thing? Um, uh, my my uh, how to summarize this record? How to you know? Uh, co compile this album, I guess. You know, I'm, I'm lost for words, so there we go. Uh, but to sum this album up, there we go. To sum this album up, it's just 
an all-time classic. All the all the great songs are on there. You know, if you think about Christmas, if you think about any song or almost every song that has, is related to Christmas, it's on there. Like it's just so perfect. You know, it's just such. It's just an ideal, perfect. Uh, you know, Christmas album. It's just classic. You know, all the classic songs are on there. The majority, at least. So pick it up, you know, if you want to get something for Christmas, but, you know, if you're, re if you're seeing this, it's a little bit too late, because it's, it is Christmas then, but still. My, might give it to someone for next year, you know, I might do that too, I don't know. It's a great album. Yeah, and uh, Phil Spector, I don't know, yeah, he's still alive, I believe. Uh, I don't know if he's, in, if he's in jail now, you know, for a life sentence, I don't know. But uh, you 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 did a great job here, you know. Despite all your 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 murder charges and you know you being supposedly a terrible person, I don't know. But you made a great thing here, so I do respect Phil, Spe Phil Spector for that. Thank you for this great record. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, this is pretty much a ten out of ten record. You know, it's pretty obvious. It's you know perfect opening white Christmas Christmas. You know. Uh, just the snow is falling down, all the, yeah, um, you know, what's the word? Uh, flocks? No. I have no idea you say that, but just the, the snow in general. Uh, the ice, you know, the ice is falling down, you know, to indicate that it's Christmas, me Christmas, you know, you know, the snow is falling down, stuff like that. Uh, you know, Frosty the Snowman, you know, building a snow snowman over that white Christmas. And then continuing the path and just building up Christmas and then closing it with a very appropriate Here comes Santa Claus, you know, to 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 peak with the record and then closing with Sun and Night. It's just perfect, you know. So it's, it's a 10 out of 10, obviously. You know, I've never really seen a compilation album that is so consistent and has such a kind of conceptual kind of track listing. It's just so, you know, it's greatly compiled for a compilation album. And I think, yeah, I, I think this might be the greatest compilation album ever, really. Yeah, might be, you know. Uh, if you think of compilation albums, uh, Piscarius, Iscari Piscarus, Iscar Iscariot, Smashing Pumpkins, I have no idea how you say that. Um, Master Plan Oasis, um, some Prince B-sides, I guess. Um, I'm forgetting something, I'm forgetting something, fuck. I'm forgetting a record bar there. I'm forgetting one. Uh, VU, Velvet Underground, there, like, like a third self titled uh, fucking record right there, but that's a great one too. So, you have some great compilation albums out there, and this is definitely another one of them that I really like. Oh yeah, not not to go out with, not to go out, uh, not to go out without these albums right there. A head full, a head full of hollow. Yeah, by uh, by the Smiths and louder than bombs. Two of the greatest compilation albums ever by the Smiths. Just amazing, I love it. Um, and the world won't listen. Yeah, yeah, that's not, you know, it's not as good as those other two, but it's still a really great one, you know, the Smiths are flawless, there we go. But uh, those are some of my favorite compilation albums, and I think I will add this record right here to that, you know, to that collection of compilation albums that I love, because it's just perfect. So thanks for watching this video, uh, let me know what you think about this record in the comments down below. Yeah, you know, not... It's not really needed for me to go in depth because this is a pretty short and pretty short record and it's you know pretty much speaks for itself. So thank you for watching this video. Uh, let me know what you think about it in the comments down below and I'll see you in the next video. Uh, bless you. Um, yeah, like and subscribe. Just do all those things I just said. Get uh, yeah, give me a great Christmas pre present by liking and subscribing to the channel. That's you know that's my wish. <laughs> I suppose yeah. I, I know I'm a sad fuck. I like it quick, fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Um, what a fucking outro. Uh, listen to this record, it's great. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Have a great Christmas time. You know, I don't give a shit about it, but you know, you, for you, have a great one. Have a good one, and enjoy.